Today we'll recap a 2008 Thai horror anthology film named Forbia. Four horror tales revolve around an accident victim, a bullied youth, ghost stories, and a deceased princess. Kindly remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you like the video. In the next story, we see a girl named Pim who is a flight attendant. She gets a call and gets informed that there is a special flight tomorrow. Prince Albert's wife Sophia is coming back on their flight and they want the same staff they had in their last booking. The lady on the phone tells her that there is a rumor that Prince has a mistress and he is about to dump Princess. Pim tells her that she has a schedule conflict tomorrow and asks her to find someone else. But the lady says that it's a higher-ups request. Now after getting on the flight, Pim learns that the other flight attendant accompanying her will not be able to come because her brother Tur drowned in Chiang Mai last night. Just then the princess comes there and Pim looked a little scared. Now a while after the flight takes off, Pim goes to the princess and introduces herself. She sees that the princess has the same ring in her hand as the one in her hand. Then she leaves from there and starts trying to remove the ring. But then the call bell rings and Pim comes to the princess. She orders a coffee and when Pim brings the coffee, she flips the hot coffee on her hand, burning her hand. Now this makes Pim very angry and when she makes another coffee for the princess, she dips her sandal in it. But the princess refuses to drink that coffee and asks her to bring her lunch. Then she asks her for her ring and sees it and says that if a woman has an affair with a married man in her country, she gets arrested, then undressed in public, then stoned to death by villagers. But before she dies, she has to get down on her knees and beg for forgiveness from the wife of the men she slept with. Now Pim brings her lunch but she tells her she doesn't want this food. Pim says that she has this food for her but Princess says that she wants to eat her food. Now Pim's food contains shrimp but she sees that the princess is allergic to shrimp. Just then the call bell rings and she takes out the shrimp from her noodles and puts them on the food plate. Now she serves her the noodles and the princess eats them. Then after some time she starts coughing and when Pim brings water for her, she goes to the washroom. Now here Pim sees that Prince and Pim were together in the photos she had. And she understands that she knows about her and Prince's affair. Now 22 hours later, Pim learns that the princess has died in her hotel room last night. The royal house of Vernistan requests that her corpse be sent back immediately for cremation. She sees that her body is being carried on the plane, and Pim is required to remain on the plane, escort the body the only passenger for the return flight. She is also informed that she will be interrogated after the flight. Now as the flight is taking off, Pim sees that the body of the princess has fallen from her seat. It slips and starts coming towards her and her hair comes out of the shroud. Now when Pim tries to fix her hair, suddenly her body shakes which makes Pim very scared and she calls the captain and asks him to come out. But then she disconnects the call saying sorry to him. She then goes to the corpse and puts her hair inside the shroud. After this, she dragged her and ties her to the seat. Then she is sleeping when suddenly she wakes up and sees the dead body in her lap. He screams loudly but it is just a nightmare. Then she goes to drink water and only then notices someone walking outside. She comes outside to check and sees that the dead body is not in her seat. Now she gets scared and calls the captain and asks him where he put the dead body of the princess. But the captain finds her words nonsense and he cuts the call. Then she hears the princess coughing and goes towards the bathroom. There she finds the shroud of the princess. But when she looks in the bathroom, there is no one there. Now she starts crying and then falls due to the shaking of the plane and gets locked in the bathroom. Now she hears the princess coughing and we see the princess's ghost behind her. Pim tries to get out of there but the princess stands right behind her. Pim somehow gets out of there and then a trolley comes towards her but she escapes from it. Now the princess constantly starts haunting her and Pim gets so scared that she tries to break the plane's window. Then the captain stops her from doing so and we see that the body is tied to its seat itself. The captain makes Pim sit on her seat and ties her hand and the princess corpse is right in front of her. Now she starts crying in fear and only then does she sees the body of the princess moving again. She comes out of her shroud and looks very scary. She starts moving towards Pim and suddenly disappears. Now Pim starts looking around when she suddenly comes in front of her and we hear Pim scream. When the plane lands, Pim's body is found lying on the floor, under the feet of the intact and shrouded corpse of Princess Sophia, with her head twisted, 